Hello YouTube, Night Viper here from ZoneModders.com um, Coming at you today with a little tutorial on how you can make your own PS3 theme This is also a release video for our PlayStation 3 theme that we've created um, Which looks a little bit something like this And it's got these icons here But today I'm just going to be showing you guys how to create your own With the download link for our special Zone Modders one In the description, it is being released today and as well as that we're going to put the website for our we're going to put the link for our website in the description as well so you sign up there and have a bit of fun we do all sorts of stuff on there from jtagging to um, lobbies to everything so sign up there and have a little bit of fun guys but yeah we're going to get started now right so as you can see we do make them and they do work because basically once you've made them uh, I'll explain it at the end, right? So, first thing you'll need is you're going to need this PlayStation 3 theme builder. You're also going to need Adobe Photoshop, which we have down here. But, um, right, so let's get started. So, you're going to open up the PS3 theme builder. Um, we've already made all our images and stuff, but I'm actually going to build, build a full theme now. I'm just going to give you a little example on how to make it. You're going to go File, you're going to click New. You're then going to name your theme to whatever you want to name it. Ours is going to be YouTube Tutorial. Okay, once you've done that, you're going to name it again. I'm just going to put YouTube Tutorial. Once you've done that, you're going to need to put an author. So whoever's designing it, say so Night X Viper X90. Uh, if you know a genre, just put any genre. URL, just use ours. And version, it's going to be our, it's our first tutorial on this soon there. And we're going to add a little comment so I know which one it is. Right, so, now, to get started, we're going to start by showing you how to do icons. So you're going to go to a user. Um, I'll put down a link for these in the description as well, but the purple ones won't be included. They'll all just be the black, plain black ones. There are a couple that are missing that you'll have to find yourself, but there's quite a lot in there as you can see. Um, anyway, right, let's get started now. So we've got our, all our icons and stuff in here as long with our backgrounds which is high definition and standard definition I'll get into that when I'm doing the backgrounds so we're going to go to user we're going to click browse I'm going to find the icon which is there I'm going to click open and it's now set the icon in the theme as the user icon Okay. now to make the sub, sub menu icons it's the same you just click browse now the first one's create new user so you're going to find that one which is there, you're going to open it and then power it off. We're going to show you one more time. Find the standby and then open. And it will add these icons as the thing. I'll show you one more time with the game. Browse. Look for the game, which is there, and then open. And it will make it your icon. Right now, to add a background. You can change the colour of the background by clicking that, but it doesn't matter because we're going to add one. Alright, so we've got theme information, which is where you go to generate a preview, where you can look at it, like so. And that's basically what we've done so far, is we've made these two icons plus the sub-icons for that. Okay, so now we need to add that background. So we're going to go to backgrounds. And as you can see, you've got a choice of a high definition background or a standard definition background. Now, the only difference being is standard definition is 640 by 480, so 640 in height by 480 in width, or the other way around, I can't remember. And um, in the high definition, you need 1920 in width by 1080 in height. That's pixels, not centimeters, okay? So, right, let's go. So, you're gonna click this little button here that says add a new background set. Now, add background one. Browse for HD background and then you'll find it. You click open and it'll load it in there. Standard definition, these are the ones that are on our 
our theme that are being released today and then you'd go to theme information, generate preview, home row and generate and that's what you've made um, so now you've just got to go around and finish off all the icons and have a bit of fun doing it once you've created your, once you've done it click build theme here now I'm not going to click build theme because I don't really want to save this to my computer because we've already got oh it's already saved so we might as well click build theme and it'll bring up command prompt and it'll build it even though ours has failed ok it's failed a little bit don't know why I have to have a look an error has occurred so I'm going to try again pressing a key errors occurred so we're going to have another look and we're going to go delete build theme failed but it will build and when it builds I'll show you using the zone model one when it builds ah oh, there's the problem <laughs> sorry I used the images that are already set to one in our document so we wouldn't let me use them again um, that's another thing I forgot to tell you guys um, if you want to use the same image make sure you delete the other file like these file files make sure you delete the other one but the same modest theme once you've built it okay, you'll get a file that's a P3T file that's the one that you put on the YouTube on the pen drive, the USB flash drive. So you'd make a folder called PS3, all capitals, and then inside that folder you'd make a folder called Theme, all capitals, and then you'll just move your file, which is situated here, into that folder, and then you'll put the PS3 into your uh, your your sorry your USB flash drive into your PS3. Go to Theme settings and then click install it will read your USB pen and then your theme will be there um, this is being released with it so we'll just show you the images that you will get you'll get these along with our nice icons ok guys so go ahead download that sign up to the website um, I put a download link for the theme builder in as well and these little things actually I better make a archive out of them so that I can put them up for you to download sorted done alright so I'll put a download link for that our theme which are both there and the PSG theme builder thanks for watching please rate comment subscribe sign up to the website whatever and I shall see you guys very soon with another tutorial thanks for watching